watch the first one real close. It's not about the score. You're going to see one of these teams, and uh, so we'll watch them pretty closely. Any update on Josh Morrissey's progression, getting a red jersey? He's wearing a red, right? So that usually means he wants to get in the lineup. The coach is going to hold him out, but he's uh, he's back on full contact, and he'll get some practices in. And uh, we, uh, as with all injured players, we'll wait till that day to make sure he gets to it, but we expect him to. Will uh, Eric still be back up tonight, or is Lauren? Correct, Eric's back up tonight. Yeah. I would just describe Lauren's progress. You still expect him to yeah, be one? Or? Real good. So it just. Yeah, he, he had a good, solid workout. The answer is yes. My expectation, is barring setback, yeah. Any lineup changes expected from last no. game? No. no, same crew. Did you like Paul? You, you obviously moved some things around with the yeah. lines. You figure you yeah. keep keep at that. Yeah, there's there's uh, some really easy adjustments to make right now with the way they're structured. Uh, so that you can you can play groups that have played together home and road. I thought there was. Know, the the Shaif unit looked like they're back. I thought they'd been trending in that way. Uh, there's something, and there always has been, between Nick Ehlers and Matty Pearl. There's, they just love playing together. And Parr played a hell of a game for us there, so there's there's a good, solid fit there. Um, so, yeah, I, I and, and they're just with a fairly easy switch, I can change the way that looks pretty quickly and like it. So, What about the decision to move uh, Brian back to the middle and... and uh, Andrew and. to the wing. Um, that, that's all role based. The um, when we have a kind of a defined checking line with with Tanavin, and that changed when he comes out. So we we just look for a different structure down the middle. 